today is the first day of our winter rebuild for the show car Mazda 3. I just did a big video on this um, telling you guys basically what's going on with this car. If you guys haven't seen it, take a look in the top right. I'll leave it for you to uh, check out. Then come back here and watch this. Today's modification could be a sad one or a happy one depending on how you like the car currently. We're not going to be adding but we're technically going to be removing but technically adding to the version four of the Mazda 3 show build. And so uh, I don't know really how to make content on this, but uh, uh, yeah, let's go, let's go do it. Let's go do it. It could be, it actually could end up really bad. Like paint loss, kind of bad. Like paint coming off my car, bad. I'm just gonna be upfront and open with you guys. The wrap is gonna come off. Yes, the pearly, I don't even remember what it's called, purple diamond or something, diamond purple, diamond purple. We're gonna be taking this diamond purple wrap off today. Now I do have fears, panel was repainted at one point in its life and it was chipping before the wrap came on. So I'm concerned that wrap's gonna kind of peel it off. Same with the roof up here as well. So I've never taken wrap off in my life. Um, this is gonna be my first time, so I've been letting the car sit here and bake pretty much all day and hopefully that's good enough. The, well, I've, I've kind of lied to be honest. I've taken a few <laughs> little triangles off. I'm also concerned too, because the company that wrapped this isn't tight, don't really do like, you know, these kind of wraps for cars or designs and stuff. So I'm scared to find razor blade marks everywhere. Look, it just comes right off. I'm so scared I'm gonna lose paint and I'm gonna have to give this car a wash. I don't even know if they like, like prep the surface because I had cut polish this car right before this happens. The car's gonna need a full paint when I'm full repaint when I'm done. Eh? Wow, it's gray again. Look at that clean paint. Oh. Now, there's a reason I'm doing that. I love the gray on this car. The carbon gray Mika is so nice to me. When it's cleaned up and it's shining in the sun, it's still got the pearl, even how old this is. I just absolutely love it. So this year, I'm going with a clean exterior design. Maybe in, you know, a couple years from now or something, I'll do another wrap. Maybe it'll always be gray. I kind of made a promise to myself, there's always going to be some sort of carbon gray Mika on this car, on the exterior. Even if it's a half wrap or something. Always going to be carbon gray Mika. There's like, I have like rules to when I build this car. Just like, you know, things, personal things for me. Um, anyways, let's go ahead and start unwrapping this thing. Um, we're gonna get some of those big pieces out of the way and well, we'll see how this goes. This door's kind of been in the shade, so I think I'm gonna start here. I know this door's gonna need some love too. I did, if you guys remember, I replaced this. It would have been two years ago and it's just kind of scratched up. It's gonna take my time. Like I said, I've never done this, so I'm not sure how this is gonna react. You see where like getting a full wrap would be a pain in the ass to take this off. That's the first biggest piece. Another thing I gotta fix is all the dents on this car. Can't tell you guys how excited I am. Just like that. It's crazy because wrap's one of those like really, really expensive things. Like if you get like a shop to do it or something that you take off and you can't get back. <laughs> like you take it off, it's gone. If you mess it up, it's gone. It's expensive, it's horrible. It's uh, It looks so weird with that rear door done and then just the back like purple. Okay, so there was a little bit right there, which is good, but like that's fine. There was a little bit right there, which is again okay. Like I said, I was scared about the fender. Um, a little bit right there, which is all good. And then, like I said, this was my biggest worry. Um, I think this has gotten worse over the years. It looks like I've rubbed inside there, so probably crack this out a bit more. I'd like to just totally get this whole thing just replaced with sheet metal. <laughs> I guess the bumper next, or we'll do this. I gotta hurry up and have this done because it's not in the sun anymore and it's cooling off. Mm -hmm. 
Look how beautiful this thing looks. Oh, I miss that like glossy end to it. All right, I'm gonna take the roof off next and then probably the rear bumper because I gotta, I gotta leave that side, but this side's cooling off, I can tell. So we'll go for the roof and the bumper. And do the bumper now. It's gonna suck. That's clear coat. Be careful with bumper. Oh my god. Um okay, my clear coat <laughs> is peeling right off of this. If this doesn't help, I'm gonna need a new new uh, rear bumper apparently. A few moments later. The clear is just having a heyday on this bumper. I think it was bound to happen. Um, so this little piece doesn't make me feel bad anymore. As long as it's just a bumper, it's an easy fix. 100 bucks replacement at the rack yard, no problem. I just need to make sure that, you know, obviously this fender and this door come out good and then that's that's good for me. It's just the bumper's easy fix, so no problem. I'm gonna make you guys stare at my clear coat peel while I take the last piece of the rear bumper off. There it is. Wow, what a sight. It's so dirty, it needs a wash. <laughs> it looks so good. Wow, I miss this so much. It even looks good with the white wheels. This is unfortunate about the bumper. Um, whatever, like I said, I'll just get that replaced. Like, I can't tell you guys how weird it is seeing this car in like one color. Like it just looks, like look right here, it looks like it should be purple. I am losing my mind. But I'm not. Kind of wish I went like this this year. <laughs> huh? What do you guys think? I'm complete, I'm happy. Basically to say this is gonna be our exterior finish and this is what it's gonna look like. Obviously things are gonna change around the car but this is our color of choice. Thank you so much for watching today's video. If you guys enjoyed, you know what to do. I am excited, we are good to go. We are starting the winter fall. It's not even fall yet, it's actually still summer. Off right, excited for next year. Excited for what's to come. Guys, keep it real. I'll see y'all in the next one.